New at 10, it's a statue along the Mag Mile that's turning heads. But it's more than just a beautiful piece of art. There's also an educational component to it. CBS 2's Maribel Gonzalez joins us live now. Maribel. Yeah, Erica, you can't miss it. It's known as a Katrina, a symbol for the Day of the Dead celebration. Brought here all the way from Mexico by two local residents with the help of the Mexican consulate because they wanted to share a little bit of their culture to so anyone who stops by the Mad Mile. The Katrina statue is 10 feet tall and it's made of fiberglass. Along one of the city's busiest quarters, you can now find this elegantly dressed skeleton towering over people on Michigan Avenue. Beautiful, it's our culture. But her purpose is not to scare them away. Rather, it's to teach people about Mexican art, culture, and its Day of the Dead tradition. It's a remember of all of our beloved ones who passed, and everybody can celebrate. La Catrina is an iconic symbol of this festivity. This version of it was hand-painted and carved by an artist in the Mexican state of Aguascalientes, specifically for the city of Chicago. She traveled nearly 2,000 miles by land and was installed in front of Erica and Gabriel's Mexican gift shop on Michigan Avenue. We feel it's our mission as a store to show the finest in Mexican art and culture to downtown Chicago and to the world. It was the idea of Bolingbroke residents Jesus Serna and Margarita Morelos to bring this statue to the city. It's a beautiful, elegant lady and the way uh, we Mexicans see it, uh, see death. So that's the way to uh, remember to enjoy life and also embrace mortality. They commissioned the artist in Mexico to create it, a dream of theirs, years in the making, to teach others about their heritage and what the Day of the Dead means to them. I hope the people enjoy it and pass it on because we yeah. have an amazing like response. Pictures, like pictures. Yeah, so. And that they have all day and all night. We've seen people stopping and taking pictures with it. The Katrina will be up through the month of November and it will likely stay here in the Chicago area as part of a festival that the Bowling Brook couple has planned for next year. Reporting live along Michigan Avenue, Maribel Gonzalez, CBS 2 News. Yeah, it is beautiful. It definitely makes you want to stop yeah. and stare. Thank Thanks, you. Maribel.